Do you feel uncertain or even afraid of the metaverse? Recent polls say so is everybody else. But I bet you know and love several movies showing how the metaverse could be super cool and maybe even helpful. So which metaverse flicks make my top 10 and do they match yours? I'm Patrick Lynch. Let's jump into the verse. According to a recent Axios poll, over three times more people are fearful of the metaverse than excited about it. And the majority, 58%, say, meh, they treat the metaverse with indifference. Because it's the unofficial start of summer movie going for many, I compiled a list of 21st century films that show how the metaverse future could be. I previously shared the metaverse Vs and how they may create value, and I used those as a guide for my 10 films. How does my list stack up against yours? Let's find out. I'm gonna wreck it. Coming in at number 10 is Wreck-It Ralph, representing the Metaverse V of Vantage. Ralph is a video game character bad guy that sets out to prove he is a true hero with a big heart. He wants to change his identity and purpose, take on a different Vantage, a new comprehensive view of himself. Ralph seeks awards, validation, and acceptance, as will many in the Metaverse. See how Ralph explores other Metaverses in the movie. Well, okay, they're video games, but realizing in the end that his purpose is important. Already today, the cross-platform app Ready Player Me enables people to customize avatars to go across many worlds. For those of you that want to judge the metaverse by those who it includes rather than excludes, this may be the film for you. I don't want to be the bad guy anymore. Hey, what you doing later? Shh. Number nine, number nine is Ex Machina for a Metaverse V of Vigilant. A young programmer is selected for a groundbreaking experiment to evaluate the human qualities of an advanced humanoid AI that autonomously walks and talks. This movie pays homage to the Turing test, a way to ask questions of a computer to see if it's capable of thinking like a human. Well, it convinced me. Naturally, our protagonist becomes a bit too friendly with the robot and Greek tragedy ensues. Think it couldn't happen to you? Instagram has already identified 35 virtual influencers and research suggests that these computer generated characters garner more engagement rates than a human influencer. They are a unique blend of story and fantasy in a social experience. This movie is all about this kind of commentary, how the metaverse is a social experiment, and it will highlight our relationship in new ways with technology. Watch this movie and be vigilant, actively attentive, even wary, because one thing is for certain, we will see such interactions arise in the metaverse. I feel that she's amazing. And the eighth spot goes to Blade Runner 2049 for various diversity of kind and variety. Our movie's gumshoe protagonist named Kay discovers a secret that leads him to track down a former Blade Runner whose job it was to retire renegade androids called replicants. This film questions policy, laws, rules, and regulations. Does it really matter if a person is a replicant if their lives are fulfilled? It highlights human agency and contrasts the role of political and corporate influence on everyday lives. These themes are likely to be questioned in the metaverse. We are already seeing metaverse weddings and questions of their legality and others facing challenges to be with their significant others as holograms. Watch Blade Runner 2049 with fresh eyes foreshadowing various policies needed to support diversity in the metaverse. We were being hunted. By who? Am I dreaming? The Metaverse V of Voracious is represented by the film Inception at number seven. This psychological thriller, action, and mystery involves dream interpretation with layers upon layers of real and surreal worlds. The main character Cobb wants to get back to his children, but is tasked with planting an idea using dream technology. Like, wow. Notice in the film, he is voracious, eagerly consuming details, unrelenting in his quest told by non-linear storytelling. Similarly, in the metaverse, it represents a world of immersive media, synthetic and virtual. Metaverse 101 says a key to adoption is going to be helping people feel present. And in the metaverse, people will interact with AR and VR content in natural ways. So are you dreaming? He's hiding something and we need to find out what that is. 
You think with all this budget, they'd be able to get us a better windshield? Number six goes to Tron Legacy, representing voracious, that is persistently truthful, accurate, and honest. Building upon the 1982 film Tron, Legacy picks up on Sam, the son of the computer programmer who goes looking for his father, Kevin, and in the end, finds himself in the digital world his father created. He meets his father's corrupt creation, the character Clue, that believes the perfect digital system is flawless without error. But the truth is, perfection is unknowable. It's impossible, but it's also right in front of us, Kevin finally realizes. Some see Buddhist or Taoist motifs in this film, accepting that imperfection and chaos are part of perfection. As the metaverse matures, many question what we can do to ensure that this new virtual world is as good or better than our real world. Metaverse advocates suggest we adopt a positivity first solution that fosters kindness, empathy, and acceptance. Research suggests that when we are happier, we are living longer and we feel supported by others and we feel we belong. So look at Tron Legacy for lessons of voraciousness, that we are two sides of the same coin, persistently truthful, accurately honest, and with ourselves to embrace the yin and yang of the metaverse. Long time. You have no idea. Pressing pause here with our initial top five films, are you more scared of the metaverse or excited about it? And which films will take my top five spots? What's missing and why should it make the list? Let me know your thoughts below and let's continue the conversation. And until next time, this is Patrick Lynch. I'll see you in the verse. <laughs> Fix it, Felix. <laughs> Okay, I can't. <laughs> <laughs>